here and talk about how I'm fighting for the Lord. It's just so people could ignore all the disgusting things that he does. Nah, that's exactly. Nasty. Exactly, bro. I, and I think I think Tom is the biggest one, bro. Motherfuckers be like, motherfuckers be like, oh man, he's changed. That was his past. Well, if he's changed and that's his past. Why hasn't this nigga took down the fucking demonic ass fucking songs and weird ass fucking demonic ass videos and shit? I'll tell you why. Like, because he's still making money. Exactly. He's profiting off it. So he ain't changed. Yeah, he's not. He didn't change. He put money over that quote unquote change. Nah, dude, that ain't fucking real, dude. You, 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 you figured out your fucking. You're your snitch. You figured you figured out what fucking makes you your ass fucking money, right? <laughs> and just started going with that. You figured yes. it out and started grifting with it, and people would defend it to the end. And mind you, I'm not saying that his music garbage. I like it, but I think that it's designed for us to like. Yeah, I, I used to like it, but now I don't because it all sounds the fucking same. It's the right, same. Right, 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 seems right. like it's the same fucking tempo, same fucking sound, same fucking just hook. If it's not when I say say the same, I'm not saying the same exact shit, but it's it just like a message type of yeah. Well, Overall, like, it's the same. Like the, yeah, like the just just the way that everything is put together. Just, I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't like his sound, man. I ain't gonna it. now. Like after doing the research and finding out a bunch of things and interacting with his fans and well, not all of them, but the nasty ones. Yeah, and then seeing how he has like disgusting reaction channels, like Froggy, go out on his behalf and do disgusting yeah. things, and he doesn't denounce it. In fact, you can you tell that he acknowledges everything that's going on because he'll do a live stream crying about something that yeah. he got called out on. So that means you're yeah. watching Frog do all these nasty things and co-signing. Is to me, it, it does leave a, a bad taste in my mouth to where I might sonically like the songs, but I I can't really rock with them anymore. Right, right. I, I think that's how I feel too. Makes me uncomfortable to even listen to his songs right now. Yeah. It's just like, uh, like I feel like he's taking advantage. Like yeah. he knew who to try to cater to, the people that are against the system, who's against the establishment, who wanted a voice. They wanted someone to come out and speak for us. Right. So much so yeah. that they're willing to turn a blind eye to all his nasty behaviors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's unfortunate. Yeah, yeah. And I, that that's all I'm gonna say, man. Is if he's truly changed, he would take down every demonic song. And and talking about going to hell is fucking demonic. Like right. and acting like hell is a cool ass place to fucking be. <laughs> it, I weird. mean, hey, my uh, thing is if. You're going to say certain things that I could give you the leeway for being artsy or experimenting or maybe even being ironic. That's different. But then if you're constantly calling someone out on a regular basis and pointing your finger and saying they're demonic, then I'm right. going to point the finger back at you. Hi, exactly. He just called out Ice Spice for throwing up a certain sign. And then literally there's hundreds of pictures of him throwing up the same fucking sign. That's exactly. crazy to me. Exactly. And you're wrong for calling that out, right? 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 It, it's got, and it's kind of like whenever he made that video about burning uh, the B Balenciaga, he has, and he has like a video of him burning a Balenciaga bag, and he Don't has a Balenciaga brand. fucking, huh? Yeah, she has a name brand uh, shit that like they were doing some weird fucking weird weird shit. Yeah, they was on it. Yeah, and and and. He's sitting there burning the bag, but wearing a Balenciaga hat, like right in front of us. And it's like whenever we call that shit out, people are like they pretend like it's like I don't I don't know, bro. Like, like you're wrong. Yeah, like, yeah, like you're wrong. wrong. It's like, crazy. Fight Club showed us this exact shit. Man, this exact thing, bro. I don't know if you saw Fight Club. You know, so so far in our conversation, I've, I always reference movies. 
yeah. big movie guy. But Fight Club is a, a very, very excellent movie that pretty much is showing in the game plan that Tom McDonald used to Man. gain his uh, popularity. I need a one. I need. I think I've seen it before, but it's been a while. No, <laughs> what's the dirt said? Ha ha! That hat thing was my video. <laughs> huh? Do what? The clip of someone exposing Tom McDonald for the hat stuff with wearing a Balenciaga hat. Yeah, the video that was going around is what's the dirt's video exposing that? Oh shit! And that's what he was saying. Ha ha! That's my video. Oh hell yeah! That's funny. My bad. I can't even see. I can't see any of the fucking comments. That's all good. It's all good. <coughs> oh, but now, yeah, it's now just I like you're saying. One hundred percent. I agree with everything that you're saying about Tom. Right. It's unfortunate, um, especially seeing his reaction and things. That's what made it concrete for me when he did that live stream where he was like spazzing out and then promoted the fucking song. Yo, this some what? of you guys. Wait, what? He did what? You didn't see that? Fan, he did a live stream recently where he was like, it was like 20 minutes, 25 minutes. And he's like, all right, see some of you guys been complaining and they're saying that I promote my songs too much. And all I do yeah. is tell people to download. And, and then the nigga says like, download my song like five to six times in this shit. I was like, yo, there's no, he gotta be joking. He's trolling. He has Hell to be trolling. I don't believe, I, I personally believe that Tom McDonald doesn't believe anything he fucking says. I think that he's doing the same thing that they did with that. Remember that old TV show, The Man Show? Yes. A lot of people don't realize that The Man Show was actually disrespecting and poking fun at men. That's wild. A lot of people don't realize that. Like maybe the first episode of Pilot was like, yeah, this is a cool show for men. And then the rest of it was, let's just show how men are stupid and all they care about is bouncing lady parts in beer. And there's what? nothing more to men. If you really pay it, that's exactly what it is. It's yes. like a a trick. It's a mind fuck. And then when people surprise when the host of the show is woke as hell in 2024, he always yeah. been woke. Yeah, yeah. That was the joke. That yep. was the, that's like if me and you said, "Yo, let's make a show where we are, I don't know, uh, liberal Democrats." And we talk about how horrible this is and isn't it? And we go hard and then that shit becomes a hit TV show. Right? And we just roll with it. Meanwhile, yeah. we literally are saying this show was designed to poke fun at you guys. You ain't supposed yeah. to like this. Well, see, well, and that and 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 that's what I've also said is that his his motherfucking ass, people don't understand, like when when Ryan says, motherfucking dude is not from America. Okay, he is fucking Canadian. He is Canadian. Talking about <laughs> rapping about and making money off of our like issues, right? You know what I mean, and and not necessarily uh, uh, giving a solution in his music. So it's not therapy; it's just complaining. It's just. This is what's happening. So let me shove it down your throat and let me say it a hundred thousand different fucking times and ways. Facts. And, Facts. and let me show you what the fuck's going on that you already know. Uh, uh, but there's no solution to what the fuck we should do. Like, yeah. the, uh, to me, bro, there's a lot of fucking people out here that just make complaining ass fucking music and that's the reason why i i listen to ryan up church dude most most of ryan bro most of ryan bro just because that dude he is truly therapeutic bro his ass will give you uh the problem with the fucking solution to that fucking problem uh and if it's not a solution to it dude it's 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 something that will get you through that fucking problem like it's not just fucking just like, dude, I, I honestly feel like uh, like it's it's repetitive shit when it comes to Tom, bro. And I almost feel like hypnotized by his shit. I had to stop listening to him. Man, he's telling you what you want to hear. Right. He's, he's telling but you it's what like, you want to hear. There's something to it, man. I think with his technique of what when he's about to write a song is he goes, all right. 
Let's go on Twitter. What are people mad about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> exactly. Let's do a whole song about this. And exactly. Like, How the hell you come out with a song called Facts with Ben Shapiro when he don't like facts? Ben Shapiro don't like facts, especially when it was coming from Candace Owens. Mm. He hated mm. facts. But then See? you want to do facts with her? That's crazy. I would have thought he would have maybe did facts with Candace Owens, but you know, it's more you know easier to market with, with Ben Shapiro, right? With right. whoever his fan base is and all those. It's a grift. <laughs> Thomas, Thomas is really good at fucking prom- like like it, it, the best word that I can c- can say is confusion. Mm. Like misdirection. Confusion. Okay. Elaborate. Like it, 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 it doesn't make any sense to me. Like, okay, here for instance, dude, you know, talks like we just said. Dude, fucking says, fucking, you know, oh, they, they're they're doing they they worship Satan and they're doing all this shit, you know. And they're not worshiping God and they're not, they're not, you know, they're not worshiping Jesus. But dude, you got fucking songs out talking about going to hell. Plus, let's we can look at your fucking tattoos, bro. Mm. Like all over your body is satanic like symbols, bro. Like the two hooks and his fucking on his shoulders. That with the chains fucking being fucking like it's pulling it like he has two hooks in his fucking shoulder. Those are satanic. Mm. Yes, bro. If you look at his shit, bro, it is satanic as fuck. Even his Nova with the upside down cross on her fucking neck. I think they like, both got upside down crosses, right? Yeah, bro. Uh, yeah, and and like, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> look, man. They they're. They're, they're trying to cover that shit up because they know that motherfuckers that, that follow them are conservative, mostly Christians. And look, like I said, if you fucking change, you would take that shit down. You would take that shit down and you would stop making profit from it. Like, Big period. Facts. Period. I don't care That's who what I you believe. did the music with. Like, or he could call himself out too as well. That's another option. Yeah. If he literally like addresses that, like he's quick yeah. to say, like, and this I've noticed this. Tom would do something, and then when it comes time to stand on it, he oh, I don't feel like that anymore. Right. Like, what? You don't feel like that anymore. Like after you made a bunch of income off of it, and you, know you what sold it. Like? like what? Sounds like a fucking rich, spoiled ass fucking brat. That's what it fucking sounds like. It sounds like yeah. a fucking rich, fucking spoiled ass little fucking kid. No accountability. That's, that's yeah. No accountability. No response. No responsibility. But you know, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I don't want to say that he's. You know, oh, no, no, no. I don't know. I think it sounds soft. Like <laughs> what you're saying is extremely accurate. Like I do understand people changing opinions, right, and growing. But people don't right. realize this nigga was a grown ass man <laughs> when he was saying all of these things. This was not like that long ago. Right. And he right. hasn't even explained what exactly changed your opinion. Right. You never had right. these opinions. That's what it was. You never actually felt these ways. It was trending. You went and looked at, okay, what do my fans want to talk about? Oh, oh, they're complaining about this. Ice Spice? Got it. Yeah. Let me point the yeah. finger. And then meanwhile, he'll literally put post out saying, hey, man, people that say this conspiracy is this are just stupid fools and you just crazy for believing it. And then yeah. does the same yeah. exact thing. Right. Yeah, bro. Yeah. That's we ain't even got crazy. into it. We ain't even got 